unfold the 21st season of The Amazing Race, and these are the 11 teams who will be competing. We're twins, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> Grew up in Sri Lanka, went to high school in Connecticut. We lived together for 26 years, and uh, we're, I guess, roomies for 26 years. <laughs> <laughs> twins and roomies. Our biggest weakness was, would definitely be fighting and arguing. Yes. If we start getting into it and both of us engage in foolishness, not in too much, basically bickering about the stupidest stuff, we can really hinder us into in a... moving forward in the race. Nobody, nobody's used it. Nobody's been used it. Get on it. Let's see. Okay, nobody's been used it. All right, let's go. I want to a picture. Natty, come oh, on. You're just cute. Natty, shut up. Make your way to the next week's on. One, two, yes. We're gonna stop somewhere and to um, make sure where he's going is the right place. McDonald's, we're moving. Oh, no, no, no. No, he's not. I'm going to a McDonald's. McDonald's. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. No, no McDonald's. No, no McDonald's. McDonald's. Okay. Um, are you, are you, if, uh, when we're going this way, yes, no, if, you, if you see, if you I see. I taxi three to seven left. Ah. Oh. Okay, bus, bus. No McDonald's. No McDonald's. Okay. They're too fat. <laughs> suck it up, suck it up! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go, let's go! People are coming, let's do this! Come on, come on! Nice to nice to meet you guys. We're excited. We're gonna have fun. Yeah, have fun. We have Don't a nice relaxation. Mean to us. Yeah, twins are on this flight as well, and uh, you know they're they're tough competitors. So it's gonna be a, kind of a fight to the death here on this first leg. Not bad for an old slow fat no, guy. No, no, my no, gosh. No. <laughs> Listen, you're asking for it. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Maybe. <laughs> you don't want to be our dad. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I bet I'm older than your dad. Uh, How old are you? He's born in 55. I'm going to be 60. Oh. <laughs> well, you're probably faster than him. He's yeah, exactly. I'm older than your dad. Think about think about him. Think. Would I, would I put my dad through this? We put him through a lot. Give him a lot of The three girls. The twenties do have a reputation. Um, but, you know, we've never really interacted with them in... They seem like really nice girls, so we're looking forward to uh, getting to know them a little better here at the airport. When we do stuff, like I want to beat Natalie's um, butt, but at the same time, I when I'm done, if I win, I'll come over the sidelines and I'm cheering her on, and Natalie will do the same for yeah. me. So I want to win more than her, but then I still want her to do well. We grew up in Sri Lanka, so we grew up on an island. So the um, elements, I feel like, will be right at home. I'm, you're never going to hear me complain plain. about the weather. Uh, you um, never hear us. We don't complain about much anyway, yeah. so, you know, compared to a lot of, like, I don't I, prissy girls or whatever you want to say, like, Things like that won't get us down. What's gonna get me down is people getting on my nerves. That's what I can't like take. If I do bad in a challenge, challenge totally like that kind of stuff will bum me down. But down the, ride. Yeah. the number one thing is to survive the motor. Yeah. Yeah. How disappointing was it to be the first person voted off? Um, 
unfortunately, like, this is not my first time having these feelings. So, you know, I was pretty good at, like, dealing with my emotions. Um, I was kind of over it. As soon as I saw my names uh, being written down, I was like, dude, like, get me off this freaking crazy asylum with Koyopa lunatics. Um, but, you know, part of me is, like, happy because Natalie's still on the beach. So that's the biggest difference of being eliminated from Amazing Race first than being eliminated from um, Survivor. That a part of me is still on the beach with Natalie and I know Natalie's going to be thinking about me and missing me and that's motivational for me. Um, I wanted to ask you, you know, looking back on the last season of Blood vs. Water, it sometimes helped people when their relative went home. Do you think it, it, it will help or hurt Natalie that you have been gone? That yeah. Gone? Um, I don't know if it's gonna help or you know hurt Natalie me being off. Uh, seeing how my tribe was, it's such like a gamble based on like who you're working with and the alliance is being formed. So I think it can go either way. But I know the one thing is for sure that it's gonna fuel Natalie and make Natalie so pissed off that they got rid of me that it's she's gonna be literally going for blood. It's, she's not even gonna care about the million dollars. Like the million dollars is gonna be the second reason that she's playing out there. She's gonna be playing for me and for us. Uh, so that's, I know that's going to work in our favor. Mama was queen of the Mongo, Papa was king of the Congo. Deep down in the jungle, I start banging my first bongo. Every monkey like to be in my place instead of me, cause I'm the king of bongo, baby. I'm the king of bongo bongo. I went to the big town where there is a lot of sound. From the jungle to the city, looking for a bigger crown. So I play my bongo for the people of big city, but they don't go crazy when I bang in on my boogie. I'm the king of the Hear me when I come, baby. King of the bongo, king of the bongo. Nobody like to be in my place instead of me, cause nobody go crazy when I banging on my boogie. I'm a king without the crown, hanging loose in a big town. But I'm a king of bongo, baby. I'm the king of bongo bongo. King of the bongo, king of the bongo. Hear me when I come, baby. King of the Hear me when I come. They say that I'm a clown, making too much dirty sound. They say there is no place for little monkey in this town. Nobody like to be in my place instead of me, cause nobody go crazy when I'm banging on my boogie. I'm the king of the bongo, king of the bongo. Hear me when I come, baby. King of the bongo, king of the bongo. Hear me when I come. Banging on my bongo, all that swing belongs to me I'm so happy there's nobody in my place instead of me I'm a king without a crown, hanging loose in a big town I'm the king of bongo, baby, I'm the king of bongo bongo King of the bongo, king of the bongo Hear me when I come, baby King of the bongo, king of the bongo Hear me when I come Mama was queen of the mambo, papa was king of the Congo Deep down in the jungle, I start banging my first bongo Every monkey like to be in my place instead of me Cause I'm the king of bongo baby, I'm the king of bongo bong Hit me when I come Hit me when I come baby Hear me when I come Now, can you win this game? Yeah, I think I could win this game. I think I have a good shot at winning. I really did this not only for me, but for me and Nadia. I was with a bunch of loved ones. Everybody was coupled up on me. I just said, even if it's hard, go the hard route. Don't go the easy route. A new survivor has been crowned, and E.T. was with the winner Wednesday night at the show's reunion event. Hey, guys, I'm Sophie Shalasi, and Survivor is trending on E.T. Now. The winner of Survivor San Juan does for envisioning this uh, you know since we wrapped up but I don't think it's hit me the newest survivor champion Natalie now one million dollars richer speaking with ET moments after Wednesday's reunion taping so what is she doing with the money
I'm going to Vegas with my family. I guess uh, we'll ball out a little bit while we're out there. Treat my parents to a vacation for once so they don't have to pay for me. Natalie entered the competition with her sister Nadia, who was voted off the show after the first week. But she'll still get a cut of the check. What's mine is Nadia's. I don't know if it's going to be 50-50, but she's definitely get, seeing a little check coming her way too. The twins previously appeared on two seasons of The Amazing Race together, but are now looking forward to some downtime. You know, me and Nadia, we've filmed uh, reality shows three years in a row. It was Amazing Race and Amazing Race and now Survivor. So for the last three years, our lives have been, you know, a really crazy whirlwind. Third time's a charm and, um, you know, kind of focusing on getting my life back together and back on track and uh, kind of being low-key for a while. I'm uh, kind of excited about that.